today I'm going to demonstrate wire wrapping on a small sensor. So we've got a small FSR sensor right here. Um, it's got very tiny foil-like leads. Um, makes it kind of difficult. We've got a wire wrapping tool. Um, typically you'd find this at like Fry's or any other electronic store. Um, unfortunately it'll cost you about twenty to thirty dollars. And right here we've got uh, two links of 32 gauge uh, wire wrapping wire. Um, I bought these in a pretty standard pack. Um, you can pick this up at most electronic stores that still sells wire wrapping bits or you can just buy a spool of uh, 32 gauge wire wrapping wire. Um, usually comes in a form like this. Nice little spool. Um, yep. So. For this, um, we're going to wire wrap um, this FSR module so that we can actually connect it to a circuit more easily. And I've actually got one right here that I had done earlier, and it's going to look a little bit like this. Um, the pins are basically wrapped very nicely, it's very secure, and then these ends can be connected to a post or some other kind of module. So. The first thing we do is we take the tool and the 32 gauge wire and insert it. You'll notice that it will actually come out the top a little bit. And we will then take the sensor. Now this tool is set up to do a modified wrap um, where some of the insulation will wrap around the post. But I'm actually going to use it to do a normal standard wrap. So where the wire insulation will just reach the edge of the tool, um, I'm not going to actually feed it in all the way. And then I'm just going to slip the very delicate contact at the end, hold the insulated uh, wire, and just twist it. And as I twist it, the um, uninsulated side will actually twist around and wrap itself right around the tip right there. And now we have one uh, nicely cleanly wrapped. It is quite secure. And let's do the other one. If I can get it off the table. And so once again, we insert it in through the tiny hole. The exposed lead uh, ex shows up through the channel. And the insulation goes just to the edge, um, but we don't actually feed it all the way in because we want to do a standard wrap um, but with a modified tool and we put it around the other contact hold that down give it a twist and watch that lead disappear into the tool and oh, there you go nicely done very secure and now the other end can be tied around a post or some other uh, device in the case um, here, I've actually got a different, another module that I wired up the other night, and I have it wired to a couple of posts, and this is actually plugged into a uh, USB tiny uh, ABR uh, programmer uh, from SparkFun, and this is actually my uh, auto FSR, auto tuning FSR control module that I've temporarily wired up to do debugging tests. So as you can see. The wire wrapping actually works really well for uh, resistors, uh, for LEDs, and you know miscellaneous uh, pin bits. So that's how you wire it up.